Heartbeat 68-64 road win for units Kazan in Istanbul on Galatasaray Medical Park. The host had a good offensive effort in the first three quarters with Luxa Andrich, 14 points, and Joshua Sheep, 11. But Lind Greer, 12 points, and above all, Henry Domerkant, 16, led Unix to an impressive 15 4 break. A great comeback in the last five minutes of the game, grabbing a key road win in Group D. Montefaschi Siena defeated Union Olimpia Ljubljana 79-57. The Italian team dominated in the first quarter thanks to a great series of throws by Moss. In the second quarter, Union started a comeback following his best scorer Bertans that will finish with 12 points. The Pianigiani's big reprimand woke up the Italian team that restart to play and score pulled by McCale, best scorer with 17 points. And Siena won his second game in a row. Real Madrid defeated Emporio Armani Milan by 85-78 in a head-to-head -head arrival. Milan took the early advantage with Aston 18 points and Gallinari 12. It's Carroll, 21 points for him, to sign the return of Madrid, 36-39 at half-time. In the third period, 13 points in a row by Nicolas, top with 24, allow Milan to go 40-53, then Jules, 13, and Rudy Fernandez, 17 for him, give another return to Madrid, and in the quarter, 63-62. Head to head with Ayrston, Rodriguez, Nicolas, and Mirotic in the last minutes, when Carroll again gives the plus four, 76-72, and Rudy closes the game. Olympiacos defeated 81-74 Fenerbahce and got the first victory of its uh, Turkish Airlines Euroleague. The Greek team trained by 12 and take the lead in the fourth quarter with a three pointers of Spanulis. 22 points for him, best scorer of the match. In the last minutes, James Gist decreased the gap with a reverse dunk. But Printesis netted a crucial basket to grab the win. First victory in the Turkish Airlines Euroleague for Zluk Nancy. Close game in the first three quarters, with the Basque led by Vasiliadis, 12 points, and Banic. In the last period, Nicola Batum was unstoppable, and with 11 points in the quarter, pushing Nancy from 72-71 to a 14 points advantage. At the end, 26 points with 11 on 12 from the line, 8 assists and 7 rebounds for the French player. FC Barcelona Regal stays on top of Group D with an 88-61 win over Aseco Proko. Erasm Lorbeck guides the Blaugrana to a double-digit lead in the first quarter. But the Polish team answers with a series of dunks and fights back, taking a surprising 30-33 lead. Navarro, 14 points, spark a 9-0 run for the decisive break, 47-34. Then Barca controls the game easily and hits another 13-0 run capped by Lorbeck, top scorer with 20 points. Maccabi Lecto Tel Aviv down Partizan Belgrade 70-66 at the Nokia Arena. After a quite balanced first quarter, Coach Blatt team increased the gap in the second and then managed the margin till minute 40. The Israeli team had 11 points and 6 assists from Jordan Farmer, who had 5 fouls thrown too. Euroleague veteran Theo Papalukas was the top scorer for Maccabi with 13 points scored. The great performances by Emilio Savljevic and Makvan, 14 points each, were not enough to avoid second loss for Partizan Belgrade in Euroleague.